Hey guys, today I'm going to show you two methods to quickly do animation retargeting so that we can get uh, the animations on our mannequin here onto this uh, soldier dude or anything else that you buy from the marketplace or whatever. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to our uh, mannequin folder, uh, animations, and see the third person MDP here and we're going to retarget, duplicate. Oh, nothing shows up. So first thing we need to do is go to our mannequin's uh, skeleton. Uh, in the mesh folder, and uh, select the rig, select the humanoid rig, save. All right, so now we can go back to our animation, retarget our animation blueprint, and he still doesn't show up. That's because we need to set it on him as well, so we'll go to his skeleton, select humanoid rig, save, and now we'll go back to our mesh, uh, sorry, animations, retarget, and he doesn't show up, but he shows up in the list, but he doesn't show up there. So how do we fix that? So we go back to our skeleton, and uh, we go to preview mesh at the top, and we choose one of the meshes there. So then you hit apply to asset, and sometimes you kind of need to like mouse over it and then click it. It's kind of like a bug. Save that. Now we can go back to our animations, retarget, whoops, and there we go. <clears throat> so now we'll just uh, rename this. Soldier, just add that to the name, and then we'll go to our third person character. And uh, an easy way to get the mesh we want is we'll just select this, browse to asset, right click in the magnifying glass, and then we can just click this little arrow. And then we need to select our animation blueprint, and there we go. So that's one method. But say we don't want to uh, duplicate everything and have a million animations and uh, and whatnot. Say we just want everything to be for that soldier. So that's easy too. So what we can do is we'll go to our um, mesh for the uh, uh, animation starter pack because it comes with a different mannequin. It's the same mannequin but uh, a different file. And if we hit view pose, we're going to see he's in T pose. Now I set this up just to show you what happens if you get um, a mesh that's in T pose. But uh, if you hit retarget, oh, we forgot to set a rig. So we'll set that humanoid rig. Now, if we hit uh, retarget on the skeleton, then we can uh, we can see he's in a different pose. So to fix that, we just go to his uh, skeleton and uh, view pose, and we'll just move the arms down 40 degrees. I think it's actually 50 degrees that I move them. Modify pose, use current pose, save, and then we can retarget. And I'll uh, just wait for it to do all that. And now, as you can see, we have animations retargeted to him. We can change the preview mesh if we want it to look different. Just wait for it to load real quick. And there we go. So that's two methods to do animation retargeting really quickly. Thanks for watching, and have fun.